In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to add an audio file to your Google site. What we're going to do first is actually upload the audio file to the site. So I'm going to click my settings menu here, click the gear, and go down to manage site. Once you're looking at your site settings, you're going to click on the attachments here on the left hand side. And you want to upload the audio file. So I'm going to click the upload button. And I've got this MP3 on my desktop. It's Banana Pancakes by Jack Johnson. So I'm going to click the music file, click open. And now that's uploaded that audio file to my site. Now you'll see there's a download link here and we want to copy that. So I'm just going to right click the link and select copy link address. And I'm going to go back to my ePortfolio. And I want to put this on the narrative, personal, and informal writing page. So I'm going to click on that. And we're going to edit the page. And I want to go to my insert menu and we're going to select more gadgets. Now when you go to the gadgets, we're not going to look at the featured ones. We actually want to go to the public gadget gallery. And we're going to search for the Google audio player. And notice that I put that in quotation marks. So make sure that you do that. And you do want to capitalize Google, audio, and player. And I'm going to do a search. And there's two of these. There's this one that's been depreciated. We want to use this one, the second option that says use Google Audio Player to play MP3 file. So I'm going to select that. The link that we copied now from the file that we uploaded to our attachments page, I'm going to copy that. I'm going to say auto start no. You're going to leave these as default. So the width is going to be 360 and the height is 35 pixels. I can put a title on this if I want to. So I'm going to put Jack Johnson. And I'm going to click OK. And so there's my audio player. Now all I need to do is click save. And it's embedded on my site. And now I can click the play button. And listen to that audio track. Now if you had audio that was in a different format than MP3, you could use the Zamzar website, that's Z-A-M-Z-A-R.com, to convert a WAV file into an MP3 if that uh, is what you need to do. Mm -hmm.